okay this b-link gt king you buy is come with this uh, pubg and the game app okay what you need to do first is to connect this remote control okay there is a dongle inside so you connect to here lah. okay put here and then you put in your battery there is a uh, two pieces of triple a battery okay so you need to use this remote control for other TV apps okay for the game player you need to connect with your own keyboard or mouse lah. okay we also selling this uh, keyboard and mouse so you can buy from us also okay so I connect with first is the HDMI wire okay this is my keyboard keyboard connect here okay and then this is my mouse lah. okay connect with my mouse okay so all the connection is done so i can control this uh, tv box with my own keyboard and mouse lah. okay i show you how to play the game if i will game mode okay so this is my own keyboard and mouse lah. okay this tv box can connect to any keyboard or mouse okay show you my screen here okay i zoom in a bit lah. zoom in okay Say. okay if you want to play this uh, PUBG you must use this Panda Mouse Pro to purchase the uh, apps lah. okay so uh, it will say application not licensed so you need to buy the license fees from uh, Google Play so you go to Google Play and then after you log in your own uh, uh, Google account and then you click this buy the apps so after you make the payment for this uh, 12 ringgit 99 you click buy and then so you able to use the apps okay after you make the payment so you install these apps so already purchased lah this case already purchased after install then you just open it and then okay this one not now so if you go to activated okay all right after activated then you add in your PUBG mobile here you click uh, add game and then uh, add here so after add then you click this PUBG mobile then you able to use the Panda mouse pro beta to play PUBG games with your own keyboard and mouse okay after you add and then you click this game and then you need to enable two things one is the footing widgets so I need to enable from here click this enable button okay back so I'm done for the first process after that then I need to turn off the battery optimization okay click this and then you look for okay from here you click all apps and look for Panda Mouse Pro okay go until you see Panda Mouse Pro okay click this and then don't optimize and click done okay then you back back again and then back to Panda Mouse Pro okay it's done so now you just click OK here so wait for it to start up okay so now you activate PUBG game by using Panda Mouse Pro okay how we work this is the Panda Mouse Pro program book over the PUBG apps lah okay so these are all the key setting here what you need to do wait uh. so first time loading maybe not that fast uh, because a lot of update so you need to wait for the update only you can go in this page okay after that then you need to go for your key setting key setting here you go to control and then customize your key setting okay I give you a new layout to teach you guys how to setting the layout of this and then so now this is the preset key all the preset key already here or oh, add to z 0 to 9 okay so I teach you how I set my PUBG okay first okay first step you need to off the preset key first because we want to manually set our own key so you go here and then you turn off this key, preset key first okay I turn off 
okay now I want to set the major key major key means that we often use the key we often use normally I will use F button for our often use key okay for revive I put it here and drive button here and then the box to collect the item I also put it here so all the major key I put in one single button for open door open door also same here okay the open button go to here also for F for open button all right okay this is the major keys after that then I will stack the fire button these two fire button I put in the same position okay and then this spring I put the minimum distance from here to here okay scope okay and then the jump button this stack together with a cross button okay uh, and then that's it okay now I start to teach you guys how to set the keys okay first is you need to turn this on okay so you see all the preset key here after that then you go to setting here okay button opacity means that either you want to fade the button key using here lah. okay you will not block your side okay let's try eh? so your key color will be faded if you put the, the hidden bar more to hidden more minus here it, then the key will hidden this thing means that you show uh, appear lah. POE speed means the mouse movement speed you're moving left or right okay if you're going fast and then the screen will move very fast if slow then okay lah. I, I'm using a, a slow here because uh, the the shooting will be more accurate lah, for me and then shooting mode shortcut means that to call out your mouse button so normally I'm using this uh, mouse tree mouse tree is this button uh, this button mouse tree okay done this after that then I need to set my key here okay first is the fire button okay everything exists because the fire button already here so means it's correct lah. after that is our movement button movement button we don't need up and down okay we only need this so make sure the W button is go to your running button here is stacking with the running button so it can go in a big size or small size but I go to bigger size lah. so because I, I want to stack my W button with the running button together so I need, need to make a bigger movement button okay for my back I would like to use B for my back okay let's see I move it a bit Okay, this one I don't want. I want a B button as as my back. Okay, my B button here. After that, okay. I cancel all this button first, eh? because it's not useful for me. So okay, gun number one I put still one. Gun number two I put two. For health button I give him number 4 for green net green net I give number 3 number 3 button but my number 3 button is not here so I add the button add a key okay number 3 so okay number 3 is here alright done and then I go to green net number 3 is my green net okay and then for pistol pistol is number five i want to give number five as my pistol for the common button i use f like f for everything like open door uh, drive or this uh, heel teammate or using the same button here okay for pickup i using t button t button i need to add t add a t button here for pick up pick up item here okay for side i using alternate alternate button use alternate button hold the alternate button to using side okay this aiming button no need to put anything lah. i just put here 
space bus button as a jump here Z button okay I don't like Z button as lying down this is cross button okay I add a V button for lying down and a key for V okay lying down for V Z button I will go to this I will go to this uh, Z button to change from uh, FPP to TPP and then I need to remove the okay put here back okay I need to remove this uh, F button here because there is too many F button alright okay so up down left right so Q for left and left pick and scope E button for right pick and scope okay sorry one mistake here uh, I need to take it back to this setting F cover everything and then I using shift as my scope button okay G button G button is get in get in the car using G button here alright okay uh, also this uh, pointing button is quite important so I'm using another key which is control key alright control key I move to here okay this is quite important button here for running uh, okay lah, I set another key for running okay let's see I still have X button here X button alright X button for running okay okay for mapping okay uh, you can use the escape button here okay at the top right because some exit button also here so you can keep the escape button for exit also can press the escape button for for the map okay after that then uh, there is one more back and map button this back and map button so for my back button I need to okay I need to off this first so I want to make it as my back button here alright here I using B so this is my back button B okay that and I put it back like this okay so everything done so this is my setting okay this is my setting so everything done so we go set and other things all right okay this is my layout set this layout exit and then for weaker weaker you use you set to this uh, single joystick so easy for you to drive the vehicle here and some basic setting so you need to enable this pick and fire okay this is quite important pick and fire in enable it and then lean mode you click tap and go to lean scope also tap okay so this is all my setting here you can just follow just follow my setting okay we go to graphic for graphic I using this uh, smooth and high frame rate so this is for better game experience uh. I try many times already with this GT King TV box this is the best setting uh. smooth and high so it will adjust automatically <coughs> okay 